back here with Atlas Defense on the range here at Tactical Response. We have a custom painted ZK 1022 open bolt conversion with one of our silencers on it, one of the Copus. Here, let me get the other side. Yep. Yeah, because you're going to want to watch the brass ring. Right. Runs about 2,000 rounds a minute right now. And that was 25 rounds. Yeah, that's good stuff. Yeah, These, this is like the funnest thing to shoot ever. I like bet. anyone that gets a chance needs to shoot this. Hell yeah. What else you got, Zach? I have one of our newest projects. This is our Velociraptor. It is a integrally suppressed AK-47. 762 by 39, nine and a quarter inch barrel, 12 inches overall length. Hearing safe. What are you, uh, what are you shooting out of it? Uh, just some crap tool, a hollow point. Perfect. Runs about 2,100 feet per second with standard com block ammo. Kitchen, man. So far, I'm really enjoying this project. Good. How uh, how hot does that get? The handguard is not too bad. The can itself, because the gas system is built in, so it has all the heat from the gas, self-regulating, so it even vents inside of there. Then you have the actual silencer itself built into it. Right. It gets incredibly hot. But the handguard, we've put. We put almost 80 rounds through a pretty rapid fire, and you can still grab it. Gotcha. So where is the gas released from? It vents out the front. Oh. Is that where the bullets come out of? The bullets come out the front, gas vents out the front. Oh, how convenient. So not towards the shooter. Right? Not yep. going to not gonna yeah. blow your head off like uh, well, some of the fucking... You want the sound to go downrange along with the bullets. Right. You don't need that back where the shooter is. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. Just remember when avoidance, deterrence, and de-escalation fail, high rate of fire, meh, usually doesn't. Yeah.